How are they doing? And good morning, good. and welcome back to the channel. Uh, we're back in the Lake District because we have got a meet up tomorrow. But for today, we're having a little wander, a bit of reflection photography, and we've got these two with us today. Good old Stanley and Martin. <laughs> Big Daz is here as normal. So yeah, a bit of reflection morning this morning. Hoping for a bit of mood and the atmosphere up in the air. But as you can see, the River Brathe at the minute is absolutely still. So yeah, come along with us and see what we can capture on this one. If you can see that or not, that's a very, well, second composition. I've moved from just over there, where the reeds in the foreground. I have moved down to this open area now. I'm on the Sigma, well, the new Sigma 20mm, the F2 20mm, FDGDN, whatever it is. I'll put it in the, in the below anyway. But yeah, giving a go with the prime, day, prime lens today, the 20mm. So basically I've got this composition here, bit of an archway, a few reeds in the middle there, just a few little boulders there. I've got the tripod quite high, just so I can get the reflection beyond these little reeds as such. So I do think it works quite well, especially as the, the water is flat. So we're just hoping for a bit, of, a little bit of colour up in the sky to catch. Whether it happens or not, I don't know, but what I probably will do, I'll probably try and get a time lapse going so you can see it all happen as well. So yeah, second composition. I'll put the first one up now and I'll bob this one up as well. So yeah, it just looks very nice as it's a market camera, I must admit. Got a few little ducks and that flying across. As long as they don't land in it, <laughs> we'll be alright. So yeah, I'll take another image of that now. I'll bob these first two on for you. I'm going to go a bit further down as well, just so I can get it looking all the way across down. So yeah, it does look quite nice as this, I must admit. composition now. I've moved around a bit from that side just to there are these two boulders are here so you are getting the reflections in there a touch. I've done a bit of a pano as well just to try and get more of it in. Obviously I'm using the 20mm prime so I'm just trying to make use of it but yeah it works an absolute treat here. Portrait orientation with these two rocks here just leading to that copse of trees just slightly reflecting the these are one or two ripples starting to happen, but there's no colour yet, which is unfortunate because on the weather apps, we we're supposed to get a nice sunrise and we we're supposed to get a bit of mist and fog. <laughs> so yeah, they don't always work, do they? So yeah, I'll bob this one on for you anyway. You can have a nosy at this. taking an image now but as you can see that is the next composition so I've just come around from the corner there going to this little bay just so I could try and get the trees coming into this little bay around here I've got these reeds in the foreground I've tried to position it so there's not a lot of gap between the reeds and the reflection so hence the camera is quite low at the moment so yeah just so the reflections come more or less up to the reeds. So you've got the reeds, the reflections, trees in the background, and the diagonal of the camera is on the bottom third, on the left hand side. So it takes you off into the distance as well. It's a shame there's not a lot of atmosphere. But I'm going to go around this side now, hopefully, get the um, Langdales in it. Because there's some ducks now, just about to spoil these reflections. So I'll bother this one up for you. I did do a bit of a panel as well, coming around. So I'll do both of them as I make my round way around that side now for you. 
It's nice and flat. Stain is already at this side, but I'm going to come to this side because I want these reeds. I want the edge of the reeds in there. Look. Now the ducks have pissed off around the other side. <laughs> They're making this side nice and flat. So yeah, it's getting quite nice, is this? So yeah, I'll set up and I'll come back to you. Right, peeps. We have got. A touch of light just coming through, but we have got some nice swans over in the distance as well. I know I said it was going to be a, a 20 mil vlog this, so I've still got the 20 mil lens on. I'm now on portrait orientation. Just got this rock in the bottom and the reflections. I will probably cut the sky down a little bit, just because there's nothing happening at all. We've got very, very flat light this morning. These are a touch of pink, sort of here and there. It is few and far between, but yeah nothing more so I'm gonna move around a little bit just to try and get that bit of light in the background so yeah I'll bob these two on for you the horizontal and the vertical and yeah just let me know in the comments what you think down down below all right that's his next on position now I've got a vertical orientation I'm just using the get into these rocks here I might have to get in and move that twig, but I don't really want to because it's going to ripple all the way across. We have got some swans around the corner, which Stain has just got. Well, he thinks he's got anyway, so if they come across, jump over with channel and have a look at that one. But for the time being, that is the composition. It is quite grey in the background, I must admit. There's no light, no atmosphere, no nothing. <laughs> but I am just getting used to this lens now we are getting little pockets here and there but yeah for the time being anyway i'll bob this one on for you and i might just get in and move that stick as well <laughs> Enjoy this little short and sweet one about the 20 mil Sigma lens, but yes, cracking, cracking lens is that really solid as well. So, yeah, I'll finish with the drone footage because I've just had the drone going as well as I always do. So, yeah, if you've enjoyed this, please give us a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed yet, please consider subscribing. And thanks again for watching. And I'll see you on the next one because we're having a little day out. So, yeah, Mr. Staney, MH Photography, and Big Daz. So yeah, see you next time.